Howdy folks, this is another little short demonstration of some macro and micro uh, pathology correlation. So this is a, um, a section of the right kidney um, with a right upper pole tumour. What you can see here is this is a very well circumscribed tumour with this rim of compressed fibrous tissue around the outside that the tumour is made up of relatively uniform tan coloured tissue. There is a smaller nodule here that's slightly paler but the other thing of note is this central really quite bright yellow area and this is a, what's described as a stellate scar. These other areas around here on either side are areas of haemorrhage within the tumour. This kind of appearance um, really brings into question several diagnoses. Um, the things we should be thinking about are renal oncocytoma, particularly with this central scar and the uniform appearance of the tumour, but other conditions such as chromophobe renal cell carcinoma and conventional renal cell carcinoma still need to be considered. Now we're looking at the histological appearance of the tumour and really what you can appreciate is that these, this tumour um, for there's small little packets of tumour cells that we'll see on higher power and I'll show you the morphology of the tumour cells but these are all really quite closely packed with minimal stroma in between and they're really forming sheets. On higher power the cells have relatively uniform small round nuclei and they have many of the cells have eosinophilic cytoplasm um, with some of the cells also forming having intracytoplasmic vacuolation. Um, this is slightly unusual for oncocytoma um, but the nuclear features, relative uniformity, lack of malignant features um, are certainly in keeping with this being oncocytoma just the vacuolation that's slightly unusual. Sections from the scarring is also quite interest interesting you can see at the edge of the picture here this dense fibrous tissue and then these areas here that are really um, areas of osseous metaplasia and even even uh, to the extent that some of this tissue is really just like medullary um, intramedullary space with some hematopoiesis. Here's the higher power aspect of some of the precursor cells. So in my diagnostic mind I'm thinking that this is almost definitely an oncocytoma however there is a variant of renal cell carcinoma uh, conventional renal cell carcinoma referred to as eosinophilic variant and I just want to rule that out because the prognosis for the patient is really quite different the renal cell carcinoma is a conventional renal cell carcinoma with all the, uh, the prognosis that goes with that while oncocytoma is a benign tumour of the kidney so the two immunohistochemical stains that I chose um, to show you now are this is Vimentin which is showing up uh, staining within some of the intervening stromal vessels but the tumour cells are negative and the other is CD10 which is almost uniformly positive in conventional renal cell carcinoma. So there we have it, a case of renal oncocytoma with classic macroscopic features including uniform tan tumour tissue, a central stellate scar and uh, often some, uh, um, macroscopic haemorrhage is also seen.